Okay, I wonder if there's an intro for it. I guess we'll find out, because I'm going to sit here for like three more minutes before I start while I wait for Twitch app to work. There goes Twitch. Bam, boom. Takes care of that. Checking one, two, three. Okay, should be all right. I turned the gain down on my own voice, so that should make a little bit of a difference. Tried to be a, do it as little as possible because it was already pretty good. Just maybe I was just a little bit too loud. Okay, I'm gonna go get the controller. Okay, 4.30, let's get going. Hang on, one more drink of water before we go because I'm having a, <clears throat> a throat attack. That's a little better. Okay, let's do this. some new info that might help you. Fill me in. Apparently, there's a religious cult group involved. They're called the Los Illuminados. Los Illuminados? <laughs> That's a mouthful. Anyway, I had I an guess. unexpected run-in with the big cheese of this village. But you're Quite okay, literally. Right? Yeah, but he could have killed me, but he let me live. And he mentioned something about me carrying the same blood as them. Whatever that means. I wonder. The same blood. Interesting. Anyway, there are more important things than solving riddles right now. You're right. Hurry and find that church, Leon. Well, we know where the church is already, Hunnigan, but uh, I got the feeling that carrying the same blood thing is going to come back to bite us later on, if it doesn't bite us even in this chapter. How you doing, everybody? Welcome back to Resident Evil 4, the stream edition. Last time we began our journey by heading to a rural part of Spain, to the town of... Pueblo, I think, was the name of it, and uh, we got injected with a virus that is uh, 
basically probably going to come back, like I said, and haunt us later in the game, while looking for the President's daughter. And today, well, Leon doesn't know anything about it, but we're going to try to make our way through the rest of the village, get back to the church, and go from there. I see an herb. Let me take one of those. I think I have a few of those at this point, right? Like, well, not just herbs, but also fish and, yeah, herbs as well. So, quite a number of things, it looks like. My inventory is so disorganized with these fish in it, it's like, it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> oh, well. We'll make it work nonetheless. I have 90... One spare ammo for the handgun. I should probably work on using that a little more. I have been using the shotgun and the rifle quite a lot, so. Oh god! I didn't expect him to be right in here, but alright. What are you, a professional wrestler? You weigh like 400 pounds! Oh, hello. That's not Lewis. Who the hell is this? Mm-hmm. Well, that didn't work out for him too well. I didn't know Leon got a Bond girl. Huh. Woman in red, somehow so familiar. Well, not to me, Leon, but I'm glad you know who she is. I'm sure we'll run into her again later. Bust my way in here. So, wait, actually, I need to check. Did he, like, lock the door over here or something to where I'm not able to go back this way? Is there anything in any of this stuff that I didn't grab before? I grabbed that already. Um... Well, I don't see anything else back this way. Uh, how about we look at the map? That might give me an idea of where I'm going here. So that is open. The merchant is over there. Where's my objective mark? Oh, it's over there. So I have to go down that way, and that'll lead me back to the village, it looks like? Is there anything that way? No, not really. Okay, so there's a hidden direction to go into the village there. And I need to... Whoa. Okay. Didn't know that was there. Holy crap. I need to go that way. So I would assume then going back this way isn't really going to help me in any way. So I guess we'll... I guess we'll go the other way. Did they leave that bullet hole in this? Yes, they did. No, wait, they didn't. That's just part of his... Part of his, uh, his do. Part of his, um, robe. So. Alright, then. What the hell, Big Cheese? Why you gotta do this to me? I hear something. Oh, there's a typewriter. Spooky door. Anyone home? Oh shit. Guy's taking a piss! Okay, well, I didn't expect the guy to be in the urinal, but whatever. Yeah, I definitely hear something. They could all be outside, for all I know. Looks like the people in this house eat like normal humans. Hmm. Interesting. Anybody over here? No. More books in English? Looks like the people here carry out their lives like ordinary people. They even read books. Hmm. More Panic Park money, I'll take it. And, well, can't get that open without this, so... 
I'll take that too. Oh, right, I kind of can't take that. Um, hmm. Now, if I drop something, does it just end up on the ground, or how does that work exactly? I guess I could drop this. It's just a healing item. I have a few as it is, so. Oh, you discard the items. Okay, got it. So I'll have to keep that in mind for when we discard things. I gotta, I gotta use, basically I gotta use the bass that's in here as my next healing item or else I'm gonna be kinda SOL. So let me keep that in mind. And then we'll go from there. Okay. Check around a little bit, anything in here? It's a painting of a lake. Maybe it's around here somewhere. It's possible, potentially. Um, I don't know if I wanna go over to the door just yet. Let me save first. Okay, now I feel a little safer walking over here by a window. Never know who's watching. What do we have here? Wine. Anything in the oven? An egg. Keep that in mind in case I need it. Uh, anything in here? No. Oh, is that the dreaded chainsaw guy? Oh, man. Well, uh, probably best way to deal with it, uh, him or her, I guess, then would be to get a preemptive strike if I can. I don't know if I can. That might be a little too uh, far to the left or right. Let's see. Oh, no, okay, I guess I, I guess I could. All right, then. Um, oh, you know what? There is room for an egg. I could stick an egg right below the things here. Okay. I'm going to take the pistol out just as a precautionary measure. I might be kiting these guys in here. If it's just the chain... Okay, uh, not just the chainsaw guy. Oh, okay, the chainsaw guy's back. Um, I'm gonna have to be a little careful then. How about the shotgun? Or actually, I got an idea. Here's an idea. Okay, 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 okay. Back the fuck up. Chainsaw guy still alive. Yep, definitely still alive. Okay, kite him around the. Oh god, kite him around the table. Kite him up the stairs if I have to. Come on then. Still alive. Okay then. Oh god, yeah, that not not going to happen very well. Okay. So probably shotgun would be better when they're running up the stairs. I was expecting him to drop to his knees again, but evidently that did not happen. Okay, first death. That's fine. Let's continue. Okay, so I go back here. Got it. Try to get a preemptive strike again if we can. Going nice and slow. Uh, let me slide over just a smidge. Okay. So, try this again. Let me see here. That's tricky. Okay, there we go. And I have what? 17 shots here? Okay. 
So we'll do this like we did last time. That chainsaw guy took a hell of a lot of punishment, though, I'll tell you what, considering. Alright, who's where here? They're not even close yet. Alright. Let's get ready. Assume the position! Get this out. There we go. Using a little bit of shotgun ammo, but you know what? It's worth it. The guy's a big guy, so... Got both of them. Awesome. I got a ruby. Sweet. Well, that went enormously better than last time, mostly because I didn't get one-shotted, so that's kind of good. Got everything here. I used a decent chunk of shotgun ammo, but I figure if we're going to use the shotgun on anything, it's got to be on the guy that deserves to get... Well, guy, gal, whatever they are. The one, the one that uses up a lot of, a lot of shots, you know. Excuse me. I am hurting a little for shotgun ammo now, but we'll we'll find some. We'll be good. I hope we better. <laughs> uh ooh. Nest. Yeah, go Palazzo somebody else with your pitchfork. Somebody else behind you isn't there. I heard somebody else. Okay. Lady with a uh, knife. Okay. Not what I meant to do, but okay. Hiya! Actually, I should probably go knife her a little bit, but you know what? She's already getting up. She turned the other kneecap this time. Yep. Rifle ammo, I'll take that. That will work. Now we just need to refill a little on shotgun ammo and we'll be in good shape. Um, okay, so there's a house and a locked door. We're going to have to do something about that locked door, but we'll figure something out. I see a box. Any bear traps in here? I'm still, like, concerned because I know that eventually there's going to be some bear traps that are going to get in my way. Red herb, okay. So I'm guessing then that that ruby is a, uh, a valuable item. It's not anything I can just kind of stick there. So, okay, so let me get this out over in my disheveled inventory. Let me do this with it. Let's move it over here. I'll take this and move it over here for my special grenades. And then we've got normal ones here. Okay, and we'll do... Ah, damn it. <laughs> uh, okay, so I need to heal with the large bass is the next healing item I need to use. And then after that, I can use the chicken egg. And then I, I'll have to start dipping in my herbs after that. So uh, here is the ruby. A large precious stone. Though small in size, it appears to have some value. So I would assume this does not combine with the Bierstein. It could combine with the mask. Okay, it doesn't combine with either one. All right, I guess we'll we'll just use it then. We'll use it ourselves. I see another bird's nest. A few more of these now. What did it drop? TMP ammo. Okay, well I can't do much with that. Okay, that is that is a decent chunk of the village right there. <laughs> uh. So this TMP ammo is useless to me because it's, you know, I don't have a TMP. 
So I gotta keep that in mind. I can grab it for some, you know, quick a quick buck, but other than that, it's gonna sort of take its toll on my inventory. Let's see if I can Kobe this a little. Uh kind of? Somewhat? I killed one person with it. So that's good. See if I can get anybody else down range before they get here. Okay. Whoops. That's not what I want to do. Run away. Run away. Run away. Turn around. Get her again. Okay, that worked okay. Ooh, shotgun shells, yes. And some more money, cool. Uh, Re-equip this. Starting to use the pistol ammo a little more. Oh, I see, okay, so now the door's unbarred, so now we're in good shape. Um, wonder if I could just sell the bass to the merchant the next time I see him. I guess it's a possibility. Okay, 14 shotgun shells and 17 rifle shots. I'll try to keep the rifle and the shotgun ammo relatively even because I feel like that's a halfway decent plan. Ah, hell, they got out of church. All right, who noticed me? These guys noticed me. Damn it. My aim! My aim! There we go. Oh shit. Oh shit, uh... Pff, I'm gonna get hit by that thing. Uh... Run! No, don't run, never mind. Hee hee ha ho. Alright, come on. Hit between the both of you? Oh god. I am glad this thing spread so much. Just make the most use out of it I can. Oh god. <laughs> make whatever use out of it I can. You're still alive. There Here's somebody else. Going off the deep end. Hello. Oh, I got some rifle ammo out of the whole deal. Using some shotgun shells, but that's okay. There was a lot of guys and gals there. Let's see if we can get away with this instead. I hear more. Is that farmer still over there? No, he went somewhere. Anybody in here? Did I go in here the last time? Probably not. Uh, nope. Some stuff. I don't want to get boxed in though, so let me go turn off the music real quick and then I'll go from there. Hello? Anyone home? I did get stabbed a little. Hello out there. Hello, Mr. Cow. Where are your owners? I probably murdered them, didn't I? Oh boy. Oh! I see. There's one on the roof. What's he gonna do if I stand all the way over here, though? He just gonna tell his friends to come kill me? Haha! <laughs> Did I snap his neck? Is that how that works? Well, he died, so that's a good thing. Oop. See one more. There's probably more, but... Nope, that's it. Okay. Cool. At least for now, that's it, anyway. Alright, let me go back up here and go in the... Uh go in here, because I didn't get what was in here first. Okay. 
flash grenade. Apparently I have room for it somehow. It's fine. Oh, there's something up there. Ah, crap. I'm not going to get to it in time, am I? Uh, unless I jump up, and I don't think I can do that. Is there a ladder anywhere? No, it doesn't look like it. Saw the reload and disappointed that Leon doesn't use an M1 gar Garand. <laughs> I unfortunately am not aware of what that weapon is, Todd, but... Uh, yeah, bolt-action rifle is... Doesn't nearly have as much as cool sounding of a name, that's for sure. And hello, Todd. How you doing? Did I make it in time? No. No, I did not. Well, it was just money. Big deal. We'll be fine. Uh, that's not what I wanted, but I can get to what I wanted from here. Oh, the church is open this time. Okay. Well, that helps a little. Oh, yeah, that's the, the treasure that tripped me up the last time, too, because it looks like it's in that part of the village, but it's not. Okay. Drafting, like, four stories in your head, and you... <laughs> you doing anything for, um... Uh, the National Writing Month there for November? I'm personally doing No Shave November myself, so I'm... doing things a little bit differently. I'm not doing the writing part, I'm doing the shaving part. But, uh... I have heard a few people doing stuff for the writing month. Uh, Espy's doing something for it on the server there, so... I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume that any treasures that would be here I've already gotten, so... It's locked and won't open. There's some kind of symbol on the door. Do I still have the medal? Oh, I have the, this key item, okay. You use the insignia key! Now we can get in. Awesome. Take me to church, Leon. Is this like a safe space for a little while? Because usually these places don't have music when you first go in unless there's like enemies that are about to murder you. Okay. We've got more handgun ammo. I'll take that. We've got a typewriter. Already shaved because you have to, also because you ate facial hair for running once you could start, but have no idea which one of these monstrosities to start with. <laughs> I get that, Todd. I totally get that. I've uh, I've written a couple of stories in my day, and it's uh, the hardest part is always starting them and figuring out which one you want to really commit to. Because you get a bunch of ideas, but putting them on paper sometimes is, is, is the tricky part. So, Like, getting them down and being like, okay, well, this is exactly what... I want to do with them. I almost feel like that's going to fall on my head if I walk underneath it. Okay, well, anyway. What do we have here? More TMP ammo. How much does that stack to? Well, there's a hundred now. All right. <laughs> you know, thinking about it, I could have used the TMP back when I was uh, fighting off the people in the village instead of the shotgun. I could have sprayed and prayed, basically, but I don't I don't really have room for it right now, because I kind of have a big fat dead fish in my inventory that I need to probably use. I might use it now, just because I have a little bit of health lost, and I would rather free up my inventory a little. Yeah, there we go. We'll just pretend like I took more damage, uh after the last fight. <laughs> just We'll just pretend like that was what happened. I still don't have a good spot for this friggin' scope, man. I guess I could stick it on the side here somewhere, like move this over, move this up, turn it, stick it there stick the cheek and egg. Like, my inventory is just disheveled, and I'm not a big fan of it. But I suppose that kind of happens as you as you go along here. It sort of happens as you play. Uh, how about we do... Because this is just sail fodder. Whoops. Hmm. 
Yeah, that's okay. That's an alright way of doing it, I think. You know what I could do differently is maybe do that. Or even... I'm sorry, I know that this is probably not very entertaining. I just... I like my inventory being a certain way. <laughs> And it is currently not, so I, I just gotta I just gotta organize it just a little. There we go. Um, stick all the healing items over here. Stick this one here. Stick all the grenades up here. Yeah. There. Now we got a little bit of space. It still looks a little obnoxious, but uh, I feel better anyway. All right, is this gonna like fall on my head or something? No. Okay. Let's see here. Oop, where's the? Where's the way down? Up oh, there it is. Got it. So now I can get back up, right? Yeah, there's a there's a ladder. Okay. What have we down here? I saw the merchant symbol, so he's in here somewhere. Not that big of a fan of the camera snapping back to center, I'll be honest with you. Usually when I turn the camera, I, I'm turning it for a reason. I want to see something specific. So, But I, I, I'll get used to it. It's fine. It's not really a huge deal. Hmm... Wonder if this is the treasure they're referring to, or if it's in that lamp. No, it's got to be in that. Yep, probably. Okay, well then, I guess. Oh, I see. Okay, they're on the ceiling. I see, I see. Got the elegant headdress, a spinel, and another spinel. Elegant headdress. So does that combine with the elegant mask, maybe? Let's see. The rare stone set in this headdress has made it a one of a kind. It does not combine with the elegant mask. Okay. Well, the elegant mask has the jewels and stuff in, that you set in it, I'll bet you. But we can't really do much with this for right now, so I guess sell it? I don't know. This isn't like a, like we said before, this isn't going to be like a super efficient 100% playthrough because I don't know what the hell I'm doing, so I'm just, I'm just going to, if it doesn't seem like it fits into anything we currently have, I'll just sell it again. Got so. something that might interest you. You're everywhere, aren't you? Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Very nice. I will take some. So, stranger, any luck with the blue medallions? Remember, shoot ten or more to get your specialized gun. I will work on that. We should be going in this direction of those medallions this time, I think. I think those that way was open. So we'll we'll go look. What are you selling? I have TMP ammo for you, sir, and I have a lot of it. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, anything else to sell? Probably not, other than, you know, the treasures that I have. So. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> I have that. Thank you. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. I was waiting for him to say that. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. I'm sorry, I have to listen to it every time. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Now that we've listened to him wax poetic for a minute there, um what does he what does he sell now? What are you buying? I've bought all of the decent stuff other than the rocket launcher. There's a stock for the TMP, that's new. But uh well, we don't have the TMP. And I'm not, I'm not planning on buying it. I'm planning on getting a different uh, pistol or pistol variation. TMP is... It's probably fine. I'm just not a big fan of the 
automatic weapons, honestly. I feel like in games like this, where you have to conserve your ammo a little bit, I end up using too much ammo if I get something like this. So. What are you buying? Okay, so we can tune up with our money that we have. Hmm, what do I tune up? Let's see how much everything is to tune up first. I don't know if I should tune up the, the pistol, though, because um, according to Steve's notes that he gave me, I should be getting a, a better one sometime soon. So I should probably upgrade the shotgun and the rifle with the money that I have, because we won't be getting them nearly as soon. Uh, getting upgrades to them, that is, nearly as soon. So... You now, reload speed isn't too bad. I usually don't reload in the middle of a fight where I absolutely need it, but uh, that may change in the future. This is pretty good reload, though. Um, how about is firepower? <laughs> Thank you. And um, I think that's good for that one for now. Reloading this thing is a bear, but again, I usually don't reload it in the middle of a firefight, so is that just do firepower stranger? again. I might do capacity on it as well. <laughs> Thank Sorry. you. Okay. I think we're good for now. Uh, I could buy more for the handgun. Uh, you know what, I might just get a little bit of firepower for the handgun. Only raise it by point two. Nah, we'll be good. We'll be good. Thank you, sir. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Let me see if I can quickly reload these into their higher capacity. Let's see, that's already good. And this one... Oh, it, it reloaded it all the way. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Steve said that the um, capacity upgrades will put your ammo at its maximum. So, I guess... I think it gives you ammo, too, because we had nine shots left for the thing, and we had these... Like, it didn't eat into my ammo stock. It just gave me free ammo, so that's not bad. I'll have to keep that in mind for, for later, because it seems pretty useful. Uh, let's check our map real quick. Okay, so up that way, so that's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I can't get in over there right now, but my objective is that building. So I guess I could just uh, go shoot all the medallions and then before moving on. Well, actually, the merchant's right over there, so maybe then I can move there. Oh, God. Okay, so we have to go to the big lake then. All right. But yeah, maybe before, um, like after I get all the medallions, then I can go and ch have a chat with our merchant friend and see what he gives me for getting all these medallions. In the meantime, though, let's just make our way downtown for now. Climb up. I'm just waiting for him to sick the dogs on me. That was the part in Resident Evil 1's remake that spooked me the most, is when they had those demon dog things. Uh, any... No, no bird's nest. Not yet, anyway. Things just jumped through the frickin' window, man. Scared the shit out of me, I'll tell ya. Oh, there's a bird's nest. What's in here? Oop. Well, there's another church. These guys must really like their churches. More rifle ammo. And burb. Steve says to shoot them, but... Yeah, I mean, they're crows, but still. I know they're carrion birds, but that doesn't make me want to shoot them anymore. But the noise they're making is a little creepy, but, well, you know. That's to be expected. Okay, so downrange here are these medallions. I just gotta look around for people like that guy standing up there on the hill looking all intimidating guess who's intimidating now I got 27 shots in this bad boy and one of them is about to enter your skull that was close somebody whoever was shouting they shouted from close by 
sounded like anyway. Let me, uh, I'm gonna run up and try to grab his stuff that he dropped, but let me do this first before I do it. Just hope no hands start coming out of the grave or something and trying to grab me while I'm at it. Oh, there's a guy. Didn't see you there, friend. Come on, lady! Put one in her skull. Skulls and kneecaps, generally what I try to aim for. I've established that already, though. I've mentioned that before. Ooh, that's rickety. My aim is a little rickety. It's okay, though. Um, now there's handgun ammo for me. Let me reload before I grab it. Don't know how much more of that I can hold. Dragonfly rifle ammo. I just like reading the brands, honestly. That looks like shotgun ammo, yep. Awesome. Gotta have the shotgun ammo. If I was without a shotgun, I don't know what I'd do. I mean, pistols are usually my go-to in a lot of these games, but having access to a shotgun is nice. I'll tell you what. Even better yet, a pistol shotgun. Or a shotgun pistol, rather, is how you actually pronounce what I'm trying to... I'm trying to say. Well, there's 10. I don't know if the reward gets better when you shoot all 15, though. And they're all on this screen, so I guess I'll just shoot the ones on this screen before we move anywhere else. Uh, one up there, one outside the church? Yeah, I probably will have to go over by that treasure to find it, so. And then some up on the railings there, or the whatever that little hallway thing is there. All right. Up we go. Aha! I see a gentleman. Gotta keep my eyes forward and open so that way I can get a preemptive strike on these guys. Oh god. On these guys if I can. Can I put it through both of them? Yep! Sweet. Somehow that didn't really work on that guy, but that's fine. We'll just do it this way. Come on. I didn't expect that to kill him, but, I mean, I suppose a rifle shot like that would do some good damage. Right. Oh, he's at the door. Okay, I see him. Okay. Pretty good so far, pretty good so far. Bird's nest up here? I don't see one. Okay. Gotta keep my eyes peeled, though. They could be anywhere. Even here. Ooh. Okay, there we go. Oh, well, I can't go that way. What's up with this door? Open. It won't open. There's a round hole. Maybe something fits here. Oh, got a phone call. Yellow. Honigan, it's Leon. The door's locked. I can't get in. Didn't they teach you how to pick locks at the academy? Heh. <laughs> there's some sort of indentation, like something might fit inside. Well, there's no use standing around. Leon, you have to find some way or something to get inside. If only I brought a battering ram with me. I'm sure I had one hanging around at Raccoon City Police Department somewhere. Oh, well. Make do without it. Ooh, incendiary grenade. Nice. I'll take that. Where'd that get stuck in my inventory? Oh, there's a... Let me do that, then. Gotta use up some of this uh, rifle ammo, I guess. Matter of fact, let me reload so I can use a little of it right now. There we go. Alright, so I'm willing to bet there will be more guys down that way. This is the door that's locked, right? Yeah, it won't budge. It's got to be locked from the other side. All right. Oh. Hello there. And goodbye there. 
I had to wait for him to move because I knew he was going to. I says, well, he's going to try to dynamite me, so I may as well just hang around for a sec. Till he, uh, um, you know what? Uh, actually, hang on, this gives me a prime opportunity. Go. Free up some inventory space before I pulverize this medallion. Mm -hmm. A little to the right, isn't it? Oop. Oops, still too far to the right, and... Oh. Whoa, whoa, hey, whoa! Damn it. I'm not a really good shot at this, am I? <laughs> I can't see where the, the dot is. Hang on, let me get a little closer. Uh, there we go. Awesome. Uh, treasure here. Three more medallions down there. Okay. What do you suppose this is? Three family insignias of the Dead Ringers. It looks like the dial only turns clockwise in either three or four increments. Okay. I don't know the combo for this. Do you just have to light them up? Like, what happens when I turn it three? Okay, so it lights it up. Um, so I turn it three again. One, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so just keep turning it three and they'll all light up. Okay, obviously that's not what you're supposed to do. <laughs> um, well, a couple of them kind of look like some of the symbols we've seen already. That one doesn't. I'd like to go five, but I can't go five, so. I think I gotta relight that one, though. A one, two, three. Let's unlight that one. One, two, three. Do that. Unlight that. Okay. One, two, three. Would put me over there. One, two, three. Well, we can unlight the ones that are here. Okay, we're back at square one, except I'm turned slightly. I don't know that I know how to do this puzzle yet. Maybe I should look for a hint. Hmm. Okay. We'll look for a hint. That's what we'll do. There might be like a journal somewhere or something. It says what to look for. Is there a symbol on this church? No. Okay. Because I was thinking it might have something to do with the symbols that are on the church doors, because there was that one symbol on the church door with the insignia. But, uh... I don't think that's what we need to do there. Alright, well, nuts to that for now. Let's just go this way. Who is on a motorcycle outside when it is 40 degrees out? Y'all crazy. Bird's nest up there? Uh, nope. Okay. Hello. Okay. okay. Well, I can't hit her off, but... Let me see run away a little bit. Get them off this bridge. I'm a little I'm a little precarious on that bridge, so oh, I need to I need to not get hit by that, so let me just uh Okay, that works. And run. Ha! I'm a dodgy some bitch. Oh, that's again not what I wanted to do. Shoot up something neat, Captain. Got anything for me? No. You know who does? This lady. 
Where'd his friend go? Oh. Hello. Go on then, sir. Okay. More rifle ammo for me. I like. A little precarious here, but that's okay. Now, I could use the rifle ammo to aim at these medallions a little easier. I know I've got a decent chunk of it, so... Let me actually move this, so... Oops. Over here now. Yeah, that works. Oh, right. I said I was going to equip the rifle. Make this a little easier. There we go. Alright. Let's see here. One... Saw one down there. See a person down there too. Might want to take care of them in a minute. Oh, this way. And what's the map say about the last one? Directly below me. Well, I'm not going to be getting that one just yet. Hello, sir. Let me just, uh,. Preemptive strikes. Gotta love them. Okay. I jump across. Yep. Who? Anybody in here? No. Oh, there's a document. Maybe this will tell me what I need to know. Closure of the church. Regarding the two fugitives, the apprehension of Lewis is our top priority. The American agent, a distant second. What Lewis stole from us is far more important than the girl. Unless we get it back, the girl will become useless to us. We must get it back to execute our plan to the end. If it gets in the wrong hands, the world would become a totally different place than what Lord Sadler has envisioned. At all costs, we mustn't let that happen. Excuse me. Nevertheless, we're not letting go of the girl. To ensure that the agent does not get to her, we, I have locked the church door where the girl is being held. Anyone who needs access to the church must first get approval by Lord Sadler. There's a key beyond the lake, but it should be safe now that the Del Lago has been awakened by our Lord. No one will get across the lake alive. I'm going to have to go there, aren't I? What the hell is this Del Lago thing? Plus, our same blood courses through the agent's veins. It'll just be a matter of time before he joins us. Once he does, there will be nobody else left that will come looking for the girl. Oh, boy. That's a problem. All right, well, this will deal with it. Oh, snake. Okay. Oh, you had a chicken egg. That's kind of nice. I saw it, and I, I in instantly knee-jerk reaction to it. I was like, oh, God. But it's okay. We're good. I'm willing to bet if there's any uh, eggs in any of those, or nests in any of those trees, I won't be able to get to them from here, so. And last but not least... Ha! All 15. Nice. Okay. Now, let me just re-equip this. So I have 19, 26, and 12. I have a lot of rifle ammo I need to run through. I don't know, though. It might come in more handy if I save it for later, because the rifle is pretty damn powerful. So, what do we got on our map here? Uh, small space. A few small spaces, really. Alright. Let's have a look. Is that more crows that I hear? Again, the noise that they make is... just bizarre. It's like out of this world. More money. Definitely crows. And more spinel. Okay. Cool. Uh, anything behind these places? This looks like a boss arena. Something's gonna attack me later. 
in here. I mean, it could attack me now for all I know. But A bunch of crows. Any trees with nests? Not likely. Well, there go the crows. More spinel. Hmm. It looks like the gate's securely shut. Wait, I can hear something growling on the other side. Uh oh. They're going to release the hounds on me. Probably. If I had to guess. Why did it push my camera down like that? Is there going to be a tripwire or something? Okay, we got to open out to there, but what about down here first? Ah! It does, in fact, open. Save point, merchant! And then, whatever the hell is that way? Looks like a bunch of walkways. Maybe. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Oh, okay. What do we have over here? I'll take that, thank you. Uh, I see the typewriter. Merchant's got to be around here somewhere. Ah! Blue Fire is Merchant. Blue Fire is also Bass, apparently. In the wild. Uh, I don't know if I can get in the wild, uh, though. Oh! <laughs> so you just have a munition shop just hanging out here? Where'd you find all this stuff anyway, man? Okay, let's see what he says about the medallions. Well done, stranger. I see you've shot enough number of medallions. Like I promised, go claim your specialized gun in the buy screen. Don't worry about money. This one's on the house. wonder what the reasoning behind that is. Like, why? what's the... Why were the medallions so important for me to shoot, I guess, is what I'm wondering. Um, I have spinel I can sell you. Is that all, stranger? Oops. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Don't want to sell you. anything else for right now, though. What are you buying? What can I buy? The Punisher. This nine millimeter handgun will blast the hole through two enemies. Ooh, fancy. I am not. So, so this is, I guess, another d decent reason to not purchase uh, any upgrades for the handgun because you're about to get a better one. This is a specialized gun I was talking about. I will take it, sir. Um, I'm going to need to stick it in here for now, and then we'll sell the handgun after we're done. <laughs> Thank you. It uses the same pistol ammo as the handgun, so it's it's not really a huge loss what are you in any way, shape, or form. And I can upgrade it, too, so that's not bad. Um, firing speed, reload speed, capacity. I can't upgrade the firepower anymore, so... Blasting through two enemies does sound like it would be pretty decent, so maybe like either firing speed or capacity. You know, I run through a lot of handgun ammo, I think, though, so I think maybe reload speed might be okay, because I do sometimes reload my pistol job? in the middle of a firefight, so. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Now I'm good, I think. We'll uh, we'll sell our handgun. Can I sell it now? It? It's equipped, so can I even Yeah, I can, okay. I wonder what happens if I sell it, like, since he's got it equipped. That old stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Well, either way. There we go. Thank you, sir. I have no weapon equipped. I would like to fix that. Okay. Let's move you up in the pistol slot up here. There we go. And maybe move this down a little bit. All right. Still looking for yellow herbs. Not sure where I'm going to find those, but... Oh, well. There, now I got room for a couple more grenades if I want them to. But yeah, we need more, uh, 
more yellow herbs because we've got a bunch of red and greens. But I have uh, no yellows with which to increase my max health, so... I'd like to fix that if I can. I don't know where they are, though, so that's gonna... It's gonna have to... We're gonna have to figure that out on our own. Is he back here? No, there's a barrel. More shotgun shells, I'll take those. Never have enough of those. And did I miss anything? Oop, I see another barrel. I did miss this. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know if you can get down into the water to hunt the bass. Oh well. Alright, let's save it real quick, and we'll head up and out. With our fancy new pistola. I haven't really upgraded all that much, but that's okay. Oh, there weren't any treasures down here, were there? Nope. Next treasure is on the next screen. Got it. Okay, where to next? Oh, <laughs> here we go again with the with the boulders. I was just I was looking at how big this area is, this little valley way there, and I was like, okay, either there's gonna be a big funnel of dudes down there, or there's gonna be another boulder, and evidently there was another boulder. I wonder if I can, like, toss a grenade or something up there and force the boulder to come down without it chasing me. Probably not, huh? I think that would be too easy. Well, if we're gonna do this, I guess we're gonna do it. Right now. Yeah, heads up. <laughs> heads up is right, Leon, because you know what's about to happen. Yep. Alright, when am I pressing this sprint? Okay. Uh, keep my fingers ready, because one of them is going to be a dodge. Yeah. Close one. Ha ha. Can't catch me, coppers. I mean, technically I'm the cop here, but you know what I mean. Uh, I don't see any bird's nests for now. Unless that's one over there. Guess I'll find out. No, that's a tree branch. I was thinking, looking like right around there somewhere. If you follow the laser sight. Oh, good, a swamp. All right, where's Shrek? I'm gonna need his help here. He needs to help me kill these guys. I'm surprised he's not already out here shouting. What are you doing in my swamp? I hear more guys though. Ah, okay. Whoa! Okay, then. I didn't even see that tripwire. Yikes. Okay, are those, like, treasures? Tripwires, okay. Wait for it to swivel back over. There we go. I dropped something. God damn it. Can I, like, go in? I can. Okay. Oh, the other guy dropped something over here, too. Okay, hold on. Hold the phone. I'll look at what that says in a sec. Alright. Oh, I can get in from over here. Okay. All right, well, that was a little easier than my... what I expected to have to do. A hand grenade. And now I'm sort of stuck here, aren't I? Okay, well, we'll find our way around and up, I guess. What if I shoot the explosive behind him? I wonder if that would still kill him. I mean, I guess a twofer's okay, too. <laughs> hey, Amarella, how's it going? 
playing a new game. Got done with Eurojank 2, The Reckoning. I don't know where that one's coming from, so I'm gonna back up to a safe place. Get to my safe zone. I still haven't read that. So oh, snake. Okay. Go bite them, snake buddy! Is that the person over there? Hmm. Doing good? That's good! I'm doing pretty good myself. Trying to stay alive in the zombie apocalypse in rural Spain, basically. Oh, there's the guy. Hello. That's ah, a little dramatic. You got a flair for the dramatic there, don't you? I don't know what- oh, oh, shit! How did you get up here? I was like, I don't know where he went. Okay. Well, that takes care of that. Still enemies, though, because listen to the droning music. That does have a nice punch sound to it, doesn't it? Ow. Excuse me. Oh. Apparently there's like 20 people behind me now. Well, that's just great. Uh, time for the thing that always works, I guess. Let me get past these guys. There we go. That's a little better. Uh... I have a hand grenade. I could use an incendiary grenade as well. Okay, not bad, not bad. Try this too. Is that enough? Yep. Oh, that's how he got up here. Okay. Behind me, that is. Drop anything? Yep. Nice. Some more money. Okay, well the music is still going, which means there's still more people around. Unless that's the snakes. Oh god! Where are these people coming from? <laughs> Hold on. I might have to use a, um, a red-green, honestly. I think I'm gonna... I'd like to save them, but I mean... You know, if I'm dying... <laughs> and I still have a couple of herbs anyway, so... Alright. What you guys got? Turn back this way, turn back around... I think I'm on my last six now. Actually, no, I think I have a couple more. One, two, three, not dead. Yeah. Yeah, okay, can I check the sign now? Church Lake. Thank you. I could have discerned that for myself, but okay. Yeah, I don't know where all those guys came from. I would assume they came from up the hill, maybe? But I don't know. There might even be more people behind me, too. Or not behind me, up the thing as well. So, let's just reload while we've got a second here. Like that way somewhere, perhaps. I see another tripwire. So that's a thing. Barrel and some boxes, got it. Aha! TMP ammo, take that. More money. Wish I could use that as a pistol ammo. Oop, snake. Oh! 
I didn't realize I was gonna. Oh, I'll take the shotgun shells. But I didn't realize I was gonna break the uh, the chicken egg by swishing it with a knife. That sucks. Oh well. Well, you win some, you lose some, I guess. Um, let's see here, bird's nest. Bird's nest anywhere? No, it doesn't look like it. I see another snake. They might even uh, give me an egg if I shoot them. Watery nope rope. <laughs> I'd like to not get down there with the snakes because I feel like they're going to maim me if I do but I don't think I have much of a choice here I could just blow that up yep and I'll take care of the snake as long as I don't get the snake in my boot I think we'll be okay there's a bird's nest up there. Probably what the snake was looking for. The antique pipe. Interesting. I don't think that combines with the mask. Alright, where's the gentleman that just yelled at me? There's another gentleman over there. I think he fell in the water just now. <laughs> ah, there he is. I can't reach him! It's okay, we'll reach him like this. For you. I'm trying not to shoot the tripwire. I'm trying to shoot the guy behind the tripwire. Make them all come running. Or just ignore it. Oh, nope, never mind. Didn't ignore it. Okay. That went better than I thought. I can't see where his kneecaps are. I guess I'll just shoot on body and then get him up here. Say, where are you, pendejo? Gotta hit you on body. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure Leon needs a bath at this point, but I don't think he needed it like this. Swampy water probably doesn't smell very good anyway. Oh, I got an incendiary grenade back. Nice. Okay, we've been down there. Grab the elegant pipe, too. And that, yep, that takes care of the treasures here. So now it's just that one little spot there. And then there's a treasure over there. And then it's the lake. So that'll be fun. Uh, person over there. Time for rifle ammo. I don't know how much rifle ammo you get later in the game. So I suppose I could be using a decent chunk of it for nothing, but... Oh well, it's fine. just be inside of there. I just don't want him to be behind me, you know? Because that would blow. Let's go grab what they had. 
Well, I got my rifle ammo back, so that's good. Any birds nests in this tree? Not unless it's over there. Which it is not. Nope. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna look too hard. It's not that critical. More handgun ammo, I'll take it. More snake! Ow. I missed. Oh, okay. He's just gonna He's just gonna nope rope away now. Okay. At least you get a healing item back for killing him. Actually, he didn't do that much damage either, so that's interesting. I'll have to keep that in mind. It's just a, it's just a spook. That's all it is. It's it's a it's not a jump scare, but it's a it's there to spook you. I don't know though. I think that uh, TMP ammo might be the first thing to go when I uh, need something to to discard. Just looking for the spot where I can shoot this little guy. Sorry, buddy. Can't have you nibbling at my legs there. Let's see. I uh, missed what the over there was for. There, Amarella. Sorry. <laughs> Probably for, you were tr probably trying to warn me about where all the people were that were trying to murder me, and I appreciate it. I uh, don't have my chat on my screen directly in front of me like I do when I'm playing PC games, though. It's next to me, so sometimes I see the help too late, but I appreciate the effort. Uh, am I supposed to go up here? I guess so. There's a cutscene up here. There's a boat. Oh, there's our other policeman friend. Shit. Vamonos. Okay. Andale. Wonder what they're underlaying for. It's just me or is the water getting darker all of a sudden? Oh! Okay, then. They have jaws. I mean, he's a catfish, but they have jaws. <sighs> and here Leon thought Raccoon City's zombie outbreak was crazy. They're literally mobilizing giant fish now. What the hell is next? Almost don't want the answer to that question. Also don't want to get smacked in the face by anybody that's, like, hanging out inside of these little buildings, but that will make it work. Oh! I've been looking for one of you. Alright, we got a yellow herb. Let's combine that with red, and then when we need to heal... Well, we have a billion healing items now, but... We'll, uh... Combine that, excuse me, with this. Colonel sending me a message, and then when we need to heal, I will, uh... I will use the red, green, yellow to give myself an HP boost. So that'll be good. Am I going to touch the fishy? I'm going to probably have to do a whole lot more than that to the fishy, unfortunately. I'm big game hunting today, apparently. Because <laughs> I got to go... I'm assuming that I have to go across the lake because there's a... Oh, there's a treasure I missed. I'll go get that in a second. But there's a save point. There's my objective over there. So, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have to go do something to the fishy. So, oh, bird's nest. That's what I missed. Okay. Oh. Okay. And the gold bangle with pearls. Okay. We got in a couple of items that I would assume the merchant will want to see. Still didn't get a hint about that uh, locked thingamajig over by that church, but I'll, I'll figure it out later. Okay. Take 
that too. How's my inventory looking? Probably pretty full. We're getting close. We're getting close. Um, I'm just going to top myself off. I got enough eggs, I think. So, and you know what? We're going to put this over here. There we go. Even though I don't uh, particularly need it there, I'd, I'd rather have it there so that it's out of the way so I can hold more healing items if I need them. Because you never know. All right, typewriter. So what I'm going to do is I am going to use this typewriter real quick. We will save our game. And I'm actually going to be back in just a moment because I need to go fill up my water and use the restroom. So I'll be back to go fishing, I guess, in just a moment. Okay, I have returned. Yeah, sorry, Amarella. <laughs> Just had to had to get some water. Had to use the restroom. Didn't want to go, you know, go in a lake without having to, you know, taking care of the restroom part, especially because that's a big lake, and I don't want to be like, you know, pissing over the side of the boat or something. Especially here with a giant catfish tailing me. I'm sure. Uh, any more bird's nests? Nope. Okay. Alright, let's go fish hunting. Uh, oh. Okay, so you just up, down, left, right. Got it. Aha! Okay, so that's how you use the 
spears. Get all the blue medallions? Yes, yes I did. I got them all and I got the Punisher for doing so, so that's pretty good. Okay, so it's not a big catfish, it's a giant axolotl. That's simultaneously terrifying and a little sad. Oh god. Leon, you gotta pull anchor, man. Cause that's gonna get caught on so Oh my god, that's not what we wanted it to get caught on. That's about the last thing we wanted it to get caught on. <laughs> Maybe it's a giant axolotl. Maybe it's a giant something else. I don't really, I don't really know. Oh god. Oh god, uh, how do I swim back? Where's my- oh god, okay. Get back in. I don't know if this is actually gonna help, but- oh. Jesus. Alright, where are you? It's gonna go pulling me along again. Oh, here we go. Leon, we're going for a ride. I don't exactly know how this works yet, so I guess I'll have to figure it out. Here he comes! I'm not going to die. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Oof. Uh, oh, my arms just barely made it out of there. Uh, okay. Okay. I, I got one hit. Uh-oh. And now I'm dead. Oh, okay. I'm not dead. Somehow. I'm not really swimming very fast anymore. Oh, wait, hang on. No, I'm dead. Fuck me. <laughs> hey, James Sunderland, how you doing? Did I get the trophy? I don't know. I have trophies turned off, but I would assume I got the trophy for it. In GameCube, you could actually avoid this fight, if you remember correctly. Really? Hmm. Well, I don't know if you can in this one, but uh, I'm going to... I'm gonna try that one again. Okay, so I can throw the spears at him even while he's just kind of hanging around. I'm still not really sure how to avoid the damage there, but I guess if I shoot him in the face with a spear, that should... Uh, can I look at my map while I'm here? Let's see... Okay, so there was that one door that we saw. It's locked right now, so maybe we'll have a way to get into it later. Once we're done taking care of Del Lago. Doing good? That's good. I'm doing pretty good myself. Did I shoot the water then? Uh... You mean when Del Lago was trying to die? I wasn't, I wasn't using the spears nearly as often as I probably should have. So... Just drive across in the GameCube if you didn't and it didn't spawn. Oh. <laughs> Boss only actually spawned if you disturbed the water by shooting it. Ah, I see. So if you just drove across, he wouldn't even spawn. Interesting. Well, he spawned in this one, that's for sure. Huh! I don't I don't know how to avoid that. I would assume you can steer away from it, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Maybe. Maybe I should try steering a little bit. That might actually make a difference. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure if I can control the angle. Maybe a little. Uh, Alright, come get some. I know you're gonna go under and then try come get me. Hurry up. I, I would assume then that I have to hit him earlier than how I hit him there? I'm not sure. Well. I guess I could just heal through it, but. I don't think that's how you're supposed to do this. There you go. Whoa. Okay, then. Whoop, that's not... <laughs> that's not gonna work. Uh... Where'd he go? Delago. Delago. Oop. Uh, 
Yeah, just hit... Okay, just hit him in the mouth earlier. Got it. Okay. Looks like you can slightly control your... An okay. Yeah, you can actually slightly control your angle. Okay. I didn't know you could do that, so I gotta... Keep that in mind for next time. I'm not gonna make it this time, though. I'm swimming too slow! See, he's not gonna pick up fast enough. Yep. Okay. Gonna have to... Make sense of that stuff. Usually just dodge him when he goes underwater. See, I'm not, st I'm not really sure still how to do that. I would assume I can drive the boat still. But I'm not 100% sure. I haven't tested that yet, so I guess we're going to try now. I'm thinking, oh, well, I don't know how much of the boat I can actually drive because I'm kind of stuck to them, so I kind of can't drive too much. I'll end up getting myself flung off anyway. But we'll try again. Definitely looks like Mutant Zombie Axolotl. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm not sure what you're saying there, but it looks like I, I understood the part about out of bounds skips and glitches. Um, I, I'm not sure what the rest of the sentence was about. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. And I'll try to drive this time. If I can. If he's dragging me along, I'm not going to be able to drive, but... Okay, so like this, maybe? I gotta get her... Okay. Now I see. Okay. Okay, I get it now. I get it now. We're good. We're good. I get it. Uh, let me just drive right around that. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh -huh. Oh, oh, God, another one. Uh. Ah, clipped it. Okay. I get it now, though. So. I understand what you're supposed to do. That is a big ass fish, Rocket Fun. You are correct. Well. So. Slide that way. Uh huh, uh huh, okay. Uh, do I have any more? Uh, yep, I do. Missed. See, these two are the problems because they're all in the same spot, basically. Whoa. Uh oh. The, the two pieces of wood, that is, they're the problems right now. Nope, not going anywhere near him. Oh, God. Yeah, shit. Okay. That wood is going to be the trouble, I think. I can take about three hits, and that's it. Got him that time. Try and dodge our way around. Yep, there we go. Pull me back in. If I keep stabbing him, eventually he's gonna go down. Which way are you going, Del Lago? Looking that way. Okay. Whoop. Uh. Oh. My anchor's gone. Where's my anchor? Oh. Open wide! gonna slide this way so I'm not even anywhere near that wood. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Uh oh. I went the wrong way. And now I'm dead again because Leon can't pick up his swimming fast enough when he's at low health. Uh, can you heal in this part? I would assume no. I'm gonna have to look up the skip on this part. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you have a smoking fish pick somewhere? Hmm. I wonder. Okay. Try again. This time, I'll try to dodge a little more effectively. 
I'm learning, though. I'm starting to get it. It's only a matter of time. I don't know how many spears it takes to kill him, but we'll see. According to the wiki, it's a salamander. I ain't never heard of no swimming salamander. <laughs> but I'll take your word for it. Like, I'm trying to figure out how that would work, because a salamander's a reptile, right? So that means that they're cold-blooded and can't produce their own heat. So I would think water would just be like a death sentence to them, because they would, you know, not... Be, the water would be... Not, it might be warm, but it might also be cold, depending on the season, so they wouldn't be able to produce proper body heat to keep themselves from dying? Question mark? He says, not a biologist in the slightest. Uh, he's coming up on the... No, nope, not that way. I can't tell where he's going to come up from. I should probably pay more attention to where the, uh, what's it called, is the, the rope, because the rope would probably give me a better idea. Okay. Nope, not anywhere near him. Okay. Alright, Fishy, where are we going? The lago. Uh, okay. I steered right into him that time. I'm going to try to open my items and heal, even though I'm not certain you can. Let's see. Oh, you can. Okay. I didn't know that. Well, let's use our fancy thing, then. There we go. Awesome. Yeah, I had no idea that I could actually open the menu and heal. That makes a, a big difference. Maybe. Maybe it makes a big difference. I don't actually know for sure yet, because I'm not sure if... I'm just not going to be able to swim to him next time. Okay, okay. Uah. A little close there. That's okay. We're good. We're good still. Okay. Dodge on the way of that. Oh, God. Dodge on the way of that, too. Where is he coming up from? Where'd he go? I think he's going to be on the right. No, oh, no, I was wrong. I was most definitely wrong. Here he comes. Yeah. So did that herb concoction restore my stamina? Let's see. Yep, definitely did. Okay. So you can heal for this part. Yeah, I was not, I was not aware. That helps. Where are you going? Okay, let's keep this rolling. Wow. Maybe learn to drive somewhere else. Good lord, man. Where'd you get your license? A cereal box? Uh, he's coming up left this time. Or just, no, he's just turning. Okay. Oh, he's gone again. Where'd he go? And he went way out there this time. Huh! Okay, got a couple hits in. That's good. That's good. I'm gonna, nope, not try again. Not try again. I'm gonna get out of his way. I'm gonna give him a wide berth there. He's bleeding pretty good now, though. Aha! I think I finally turned him over. Uh oh. Careful now, Leon. We don't want to end up back in his mouth. Uh oh. Untie it, quick! Untie it! <laughs> Get this shit off of me! Oh. Okay. Phew! I think we both need a breather <laughs> at this point. Hey, Garrick, how's it going? Salamanders are a group of amphibians typically characterized by a lizard-like appearance. Just a quick Google search. Yeah, I guess if they're amphibians, then that's fair. I'm thinking they're reptiles, but again, I'm no ecologist, so.
Ah, oh, that's kind of gross. Well, I did all that work for nothing. I died anyway. Kind of. End of chapter. My, my hit ratio is still doing pretty good, though. And that's actually, yeah, the end of chapter one. So now we're moving into chapter two. Oh, boy. Uh, I've killed 136 enemies and died four times. All of them in this section. So that's great. You had Country Road sung by a toad the whole fight. I saw that video. It was in my recommended today, and I don't understand what the fuck. <laughs> Why did I die? Oh, the big fishy wanted to wanted to eat me, and I actually let him. So, <laughs> yeah, not the smartest plan. I also got my head cut off by some dude with a chainsaw once, so that wasn't very much fun. Just trying to shoot him in the kneecaps. And he didn't fall over. It just used a green herb, duh. <laughs> Parasites in my body. Oh, that's not good. Well, that's kind of gross. Can leave that bit again on the Discord, don't forget to watch. I was wondering where you put it. I was gonna watch it when the stream was over last time. I went to look at it and I'm like, what the hell? Where'd it go? Did you delete it or something? Yeah, you missed me losing my head. It's been six hours. Don't worry, MRL, I'm sure it'll happen again. <laughs> don't you mean lonely? Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and I guess I must have lost consciousness. Lost consciousness? Yeah. Maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about. Hmm. hmm. I'm all right now. I'm going to continue my mission. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to keep going then. I'm going to eat a chicken egg, I think. I got him. I may as well. There we go. I think I need to use a couple grenades. I've got two flashes, two incendiaries, and I'll keep two. I'll try to keep two hand grenades if I can. But, uh, yeah. I'll go from there. Oh. Okay, so a few things in here then. Hey, look, another flash grenade list like I was talking about. Handgun ammo. Take that. There's a note on the bed. I'll get that in a sec. Does this open up? Check. Nothing unusual here. Okay. Does not open up. What does this say? Deleted from Discord after you came to the stream last second before I ended it. Oh, okay, gotcha. Well, I'll check it out when we're done today. Anonymous letter. There's an important item hidden in the falls. If you're able to get it, you might be able to get Ashley out of the church. But I'll warn you, the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They've deployed what's called an El Gigante, so God bless. About what's been going on in your body, if I could help you, I would. But unfortunately, it's beyond my power. I think Lewis probably wrote this one. So we'll have to, we'll have to see. Man, it's dirty. Glad I didn't sleep on that. I mean, I know I slept on the floor, but still. So apparently Lewis found us while we were slapped on the ground unconscious. So that's just great. Where's Leon find that perfectly smooth and identical background every time he calls Hunnigan? That's, that's a question, yeah. Dr. Salvador is the chainsaw guy? Oh, okay. That's his name, Dr. Salvador. Got it. Okay. I know we just saved, but I did pick up a couple of items, so I think we might as well again. Are we on the other side of the thing right now? Oh, that's not the right button. Yeah, we are on the other side of the thing. The lake, that is. Which now has an opening and a merchant at it. Okay. Merchant's also over there. Still a treasure in there. Guess we gotta watch out for El Gigante, whatever it is. But apparently we're going down that way first. Oh, it's raining. Let's look around and see if there's anybody hanging out out here. I should probably go see the. Whoop. Is that a fish? Yeah, it's a, a big bass. Okay. Should probably go see the merchant. Waterfall. 
I think I'm gonna go see the merchant before I uh, before I go that way. Well, hmm. Now I'm not so sure because we have to come back this way anyway. I think unless there's like a. I mean, I guess I could get like smacked over the head or something inside of there and then teleported back. So I'm gonna go see the merchant now. Now that I know that El Gigante is dead. Or not El Gigante, uh, Del Lago. El Gigante is something else. Let's not run into too much of a wall. There we go. Let's see what the merchant has in stock today. I wonder if he had his shop closed up because he was thinking he didn't want Del Lago to go messing him up. Okay. I'm glad there wasn't a snake in that middle one, because I would have missed it again. Okay. Some more stuff to purchase. Very good. Or for purchasing, rather. Okay, nothing in that one. Sorry for busting up all your barrels. I need all the help I can get. Some rare things on sale, stranger. Rare things like what? Actually, what first, let me, let me sell you a few things. I got a few things I can give you. Um, an antique pipe. Detailed engraving on this pipe. Let's hope it's worth something. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> it's worth something. Excuse me. And gold bangled pearls. The fantastic worksmanship of this accessory makes this a valuable item. Very good. Ah. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. And we're still looking for another yellow herb to use with our red and green there. I have TMP ammo for you as well. Stranger? <laughs> Did I have any spinel? Thank you. Let's see. No. No, I must have sold you the last of my spinel uh, before. Okay. And if I remember right, what Steve said there was a new it? weapon available in this chapter. But it's not available yet. Okay, that's fine. Uh, do I tune up? Let's see. The skip you watched, you shoot the water quickly, switch to the RPG, and shoot the Del Lago? Oh, okay. Well, that would make sense. It would definitely deal enough damage there. But I didn't buy the rocket launcher, so I uh, don't know if that's going to help us any. Uh, what did I not get? I didn't get reload speed last time. I almost want to get firepower instead, but I guess I can get reload speed. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. And let's get Is more firepower as well. <laughs> Thank you. The capacity should be okay for now. As for the shotgun, we'll get reload Is speed that again. All, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. And yeah, Is that all, firepower. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. I'm not going to worry about uh, upgrading the Punisher right now either, because even though it is a better pistol than the one that I had, the handgun, um, we're actually probably, according to Steve's notes that he left me, we're probably going to be getting a better uh, pistol uh, in this in this section. So that's what hopefully we're going to do. I'm just glad my boat didn't float away, because that would have been bad. Keep the beer's time which seems to be smart enough to do as is because you can put gems into it to increase its value. Yeah, I I noticed that. We got a um well Steve actually told me on the first stream, he said, hey, the elegant mask and the beer stein, keep those because you can slot stuff into them. But uh, even if he hadn't told me that, I mean I've been examining most of the valuable items that we get anyway. So I've just been like, okay. So can you slot anything into these items? Yes, no, and if it's a no, then I'll sell them. If it's a yes, <laughs> like if it says it looks like there's holes in this thing to slot stuff in. I'll keep it. Um, but if there isn't holes in it, that's usually when I'll be like, okay, let's just let's just get rid of it. All right. So here we go. Here we go. Punisher's actually the weakest handgun in the game. Oh, okay. Well, it's been doing pretty good for me so far. I'm not planning on upgrading it um, beyond a certain point, and that certain point is probably going to be the end of this chapter. So it's not going to be 
really all that good. It's probably the worst fully upgraded. Um, probably worse than the handgun fully upgraded. Did, were his eyeballs that color before? Oh, okay. Now that... Oh my god, it's right on top of me. Now that could be a problem. Um, I do know what to do to these things, though. If you flash grenade a parasite, it kills it instantly. Or at least that type of parasite, anyway. So, that will help a little bit. Oh god, I was trying to knife you, sir. Or rather, kick you. See ya! Ooh, that's some gold bars. Nice. Alright, bring it on. A little closer. Just a little. What if his parasite, like, pops out when I kill him? Oh, God. I was right! Back up. So I could probably kill it without flash grenades, but I figure if I've got him... May as well use them, you know. I don't think they tell you that anywhere, though. That's just a tip that Steve left me before he left today. He said, hey, if you run into any parasites, use those flash grenades you got. And I said, okay. So. Uh, I can't go that way. I can't go this way. Oh, okay. Well... That there's no Del Lago in there to smash the bridge or something. Its advantage is I5S penetrating multiple enemies at once. Its advantage is penetrating multiple enemies at once. Right, yeah, because it said it can shoot through two enemies. Looking forward to playing Exit Kiwami Heard it's been on Steam Sale. I'll have to look, because um, I think Steam Sale ended recently. Their, their Halloween sale, I think it ended recently, so I'll have to check it out and see if it's still on there. It may be. Um, but we'll. I'll look. I'll, I'll do some investigating. Find out for myself. Uh, okay, so. More guys. I could use the rifle to look. Should have waited for the last moment to shoot and then go for a visceral attack. Wait. <laughs> yeah. If it was that game, I definitely would have. But uh, unfortunately, we're a little limited on our capacity to visceral attack. Unfortunately, they didn't give Leon a katana before he left the Raccoon City Police Department. If they did, this game would probably already be over. <laughs> Let's see. Uh... Ah. Before I do... You know, the... Oh, hang on. The enemies, I was going to say, might not spawn until I get down there. But here's a dude right here, just waiting to be sniped. Alright, now it's going to come. I hope I can get his stuff in time. I can if I do this. Rifle ammo, nice. Paid off. I don't see any other people. That doesn't mean they're not here. I just don't see them yet. 3,300? Wow, we're getting a lot more money now. Uh, let's see. Any treasures to get? Yes, across this other side of the thing. Yeah. Oop. And then we got ammo. I'll just also take that. Hmm. Is that... No, hang on. I should be able to get over that. Yeah, I can get here with this. Okay. Okay. More spinel. Nice. Uh, yeah, I can 
rotated to stop the water from flowing? Perhaps. Because I don't think... I can get across directly from there. I suppose I could try and grab a... Uh, box, but... Unless it wants me to climb over? No. About up here. Is there anything up here that would let me help help me get across? Fair. I think katanas aren't standard issue really anywhere now, let alone the Secret Service. Yeah, that's that's pretty fair. Yeah. <laughs> if Leon had one, I'd be a little concerned. So, can we talk about that one guy in the cathedral for the final quest of the Aileen sub story? That guy killed you more than most of the Chalice bosses so far. There's a water. Oh, there is a waterfall skip. I'm not looking for skips and stuff. This is the first playthrough, so I'm kind of trying to, you know, trying to keep it real. You know what I'm saying? Of course, if I can't find my way across, that will make it harder to keep it real. But... Yeah, there's no interactable there. And unless I shoot this, maybe. Well, that helps. Okay. That'll make a difference, won't it? Let's see. Grab this. An amber ring. There's probably a secret behind the waterfall, but we'll go get that in a minute. I'll probably shoot that, too. Do it wrong and it's the endless fall. Oh god. <laughs> Let's not soft lock then. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Oh, greener. I'll take that. Um, I wonder if you have to shoot this in a specific place for it to go where you want it to go. Doesn't appear so. So let's go this way and jump on over. Oh. Yeah, I can. I guess I need another box, don't I? My aim is a little off. It's okay though, I got like a hundred pistol ammo, so. Soft locking is a lovely idea, yeah. Not my first plan of action, I'll say that much. I would prefer not. Thank you. Okay, so. Well, if there was a snake there, I don't even know if I would have been able to knife it, I'll be honest. But, uh, probably would have been too close to me. Pull the lever! Shut off the falls. Uh, it turns the gears. Aha! So it will turn off the falls. It'll dam it up. Redirect the flow of the water. Yeah, that probably would have hurt if we would have gone underneath that. Having been under a waterfall before in my life, it, uh, depending on the flow of the water, how fast it is, and how much water's going over, it can uh, make a difference in how much it hurts. Fuck. Hold, hold the phone. Hold the phone here. Um, I have incendiaries. I'll use those in a second. Oh, shit. Uh, I have an idea. Run. Run quite a bit, and then turn around, and, uh, have an incendiary, friends. Okay, it appears that I didn't quite get all of them. That's okay. Uh, 
I miss anything back here? No. Didn't miss anything yet. Ow. Yikes! Uh, hold on. I'm gonna try to shoot it with the rifle. Okay. Cool. Money, money. Rifle ammo. More rifle ammo. Are these guys still over here, or did they all come this way? They all came this way. They probably all jumped across, I'll bet. can just use reload if you activate the switch, it's a checkpoint. If you get a bigger red dot, it's a shootable object. Uh, yeah, 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 I've noticed that. Yep. Okay. Speaking of which, or speaking of reloading, let's reload all our guns. There we go. And now for... The Punisher. There we go. Okay. So what do you suppose is in the deep, dank cave? Let's go have a look. Um... There appears to be a branch in the path here, but I could be wrong. Let's see. Yeah, it's not a branch, that's a that's a drop. Can't go in there. Ooh. What do you suppose this is? Take the round insignia? Sure. You got the round insignia. Nice. Oh, and it unlocked a shortcut, it looks like. Oh, got a phone call. Yellow. I've obtained an object that resembles a cult group's insignia. Wonderful, Leon. Head back to the church. Ashley's safety is our immediate priority. A monkey, that's what, yeah. <laughs> Nobody here but me, the monkey. I wonder where this door leads. Somewhere. Somewhere I haven't been yet, it looks like, but perhaps... The oh. I forgot a treasure over by the merchant's place. Hold on. I'll be back. Because <laughs> that treasure might be important. So let's go. I know, I, I know I'm backtracking quite a bit. I probably should have checked this before I came all the way over here, but... Yeah, I don't know if we'll be able to get back there now, so... Well, after this. So let's just go get it. I should be able to climb back up the rope. It might be a bit of a trek, but... Yep. Let's see if any new, buddy, new people spawned up here. New bodies. Warm bodies? Well, they're probably not warm anymore. It's kind of raining. Even if they were warm bodies, I don't think I want them giving me a hug. I'll be honest with you. Thought that was people back here, but nope. There might be people back here now, but you know. He holds the phone, walkie talkie, whatever the heck to his ear, then it shows his face. Yeah. Leon's uh, abilities with the with the satellite phone are quite the enigma, that's for sure. Let's go find this thing that I missed, and then we'll we'll head for shore, and we'll head back through this shortcut that's probably under the waterfall there. Let's slow it down gently. Don't want to crash or something. All right, if I were a treasure, where would I be hiding? You got something stuck to your ceiling or something there, man? Here. Uh, up top? How do I get up top? Oh, okay. I see. That's how. Rifle ammo, I'll take that. And what else is on the roof? A box pushing puzzle. Oh boy. Should be able to just push this straight. Yep. And then slide my way in. Okay. 
Rifle ammo. Ooh. The green gem. I would bet that's the treasure that I was looking for. Some more play money. Is this a jump down point? Yep. Huh. Sorry for uh, dropping in there, man. Oh. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. I was expecting him to be like, "Do you mind if I take that stuff?" I was expecting him to be kind of upset with me being back here, but okay. I'll, I'm glad that you're such a such a good fellow. He's just so chill. <laughs> A uh, green gem. What do we do with a green gem? It's not a cat's eye, so that means it probably doesn't... I have 70 million rifle ammo. What the hell? I'm gonna need to do something about this. Guess I'll stick it down there. I guess that shows you where my priorities usually are, though, huh? Usually my priorities lie a little closer to use the shotgun. <laughs> okay, so... Spindle? Amber ring? Let's check it out. An old ring. I can almost feel the history behind this jewelry. I just hope there's some value to it. We shall find out, Leon. We shall find out. Green gem. The markings on the piece indicate that it was once set in something. I will bet it's set in this. Yep. Because the things that go in the Bierstein are the cat's eyes. So apparently I'm looking for gems for the elegant mask. Got it. Okay. You know, I'll sell a couple of things while I'm here. I may as well. And then we'll move from here. What are you selling? It depends. What are you taking? Is that all strength? <laughs> Thank you. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. And we're good. Thank you, sir. As I said before, you're a gentleman and a scholar. Let's get out of here, now that I got the treasure. And that should be that marked off. Yep, cool. We got that one. So now we just got to backtrack to that church. I think I know where we're going to come out, though, thinking about it. There was that one locked door directly next to the church. Uh, where uh, the door was locked from the inside. So, we might come out right there. Alright. Uh, what did Colonel message me about earlier, anyway? Oh, okay. It's a forward from my e other email address. I have my YouTube business email address, and then I have my personal email address, and it's, uh... Try to try to keep them separate, but I have everything kind of forwarded to one because I usually only check one of them. So, it's funny though because I, I still call it my YouTube business email address, even though I don't use YouTube as a business really. It's it's more just there in case it ever becomes something like that. But you know. I suppose if I ever get enough, um, like, tips and stuff from doing this, I'm not sure... I'm not exactly sure how that goes, where you have to report your income for those sorts of things. I would assume if you don't, if you don't make a certain amount, you don't have to report it. But I would have to talk to my father's accountant about that one. I'm not quite an accountant myself, so I don't really know how that all works yet. Okay. Well, that didn't take too long. Oh, there's barrels and another... Oh, okay, bats. Hi. Are they gonna, like... Why are you freaking out, Leon? Are they gonna, like, eat me or something? Get out of here. Because Leon's freaking out about the bats, so I, that's the only reason why I'm... murdering the poor bastards. 
it's fine. We'll be fine. They don't appear to be doing any damage to me, so... And they don't, also don't seem to be... Uh, they seem to be respawning rather quickly, so... We'll just, we'll just leave them be and we'll go this way, see where it takes us. Oh, I know where we are now. Okay. We are back in the merchant's area over here. Let's see if he uh, flew over here himself. He did. Hey, man. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. He doesn't appear to have anything new right now, though. They received the one terabyte of smoking animals pick. That meant you'll have found my personal email. Okay. <laughs> That's going to be something I'll have to prepare for, that's for sure. Okay, he doesn't have anything new right now. Got it. So let's save real quick. And then we'll head up and out. We're going up towards that little circular arena area, aren't we? Oh boy. I feel a boss fight coming on. Because, like, look at that area up there. Like, that's, that's prime size for a boss fight. So, I think we have to, before we go into that section over there, that we have to go see the merchant over there. Maybe. Well, we'll see. Let me get back up here first. We'll worry about one thing at a time for now. Oh, there's barrels here now. Somebody loaded something up here. Any people out there? No, but looks like they closed the gate. That's just... Oh, okay. That's just great. I, I saw the lightning and I was like, wait, is there actually something over there? But, uh, it's lightning. So, there might be something over here, especially given the cutscene, but it isn't over here yet. Oh, okay, that's where the gate was. I get a bad feeling about this. Uh, that doesn't look like demon dogs. You can rapido later. You're not gonna. Yeah, I was gonna say you're not gonna get it, man. Maybe you guys should have pulled it out there before you shut the gates. So, oh my god. So you wouldn't get murdered by the giant. Troll, ogre, cyclops looking thing. Ooh, he's not happy with you. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Watch out, Leon. Great. Okay, now what? I'm gonna run behind the houses! Oh, there's stuff in the houses. That wasn't worth it. That wasn't worth it! Did you destroy one of the houses? Yep. Oh, God. I hope he doesn't have a charging attack, because I don't really have anywhere to go for that. No, he didn't destroy one of the houses. Okay. Not yet, anyway. Puppy! Hey, buddy! Hey, it's that dog. Oh, so he'll distract him for me. Okay, interesting. I see the weak spot on your back. The rest of them was hard as a rock, though. Watch out, pup! Red herb here too. I don't know why I'm grabbing these in the middle of the boss fight, but I'll. Oh god! Oh god. Don't come near me, pup. <laughs> it's kind of hard to kite them when you're walking near me. Oh god! Bite him, pup! Bite him! Okay, I hit his weak spot anyway. Be careful, pup. I don't want you dying on me just because this guy wants to be a 
jackass. Spinel, shotgun shells, money. Okay, well. Cow. Run! I had a feeling he was charging. Who said you could be charging truck today? Okay. Not on the right line. His, uh... Oh, there's a yellow herb there. I'll take that in a second. I don't know why I'm using the Punisher for this. I should be using my rifle. Hold on. I'll, I'll switch to that. Let me just do this first. Okay. So. Red herb. Let me combine that. Okay. Let's equip the rifle. Aim is off. Is he coming after me? Yeah. Okay. I grab this while I'm at it. Okay, let's quickly combine that with one of the red greens we've got. Uh, that one. All right, we got our healing and health upgrade there. Wow. Uh -oh. Say, run, Leon, run! Here he come. Okay, is he after me still? Nope. Doggo. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, I hit him in the wrong spot, but I also sort of hit him in the right spot. Oh. Okay. Shadow of the Colossus, this bitch! <laughs> I should probably run for cover, though. I wonder if these houses act as cover for you. Right, run, Leon, run! He, he kills me in two hits, doesn't he? I should probably use the, uh... should probably use the, uh, HP bonus. There we go. I'm gonna get hit again. Ow. Can't go under his legs, apparently. It's a shame. So I really do have to wait for him to be on the dog. Okay, that looked like a good shot. So does that. And again, mount him. <laughs> Probably one more of these sec sections and then we'll be good. <sighs> I just gotta remember this is bolt action so I can't just pull the trigger while he's walking towards me. I'd like to turn around and see where he is, but I don't think it's a good idea. Oh, God. Uh! Yep. Um, I don't have any chicken eggs left. Let's use one of the green herbs we've got. Might as well. I got a bunch of them burning a hole in my pocket anyway, so... Now, going after the pup. Okay, good. Time to die, then. That's a good shot. Nice. Thanks, pup. I don't know if he actually takes more damage when you shoot him there, but I'm trying to. Me! Me! Run! Oh 
god. Watch out, pup. You know, when he's on me, I really should be equipping the pistol. So I can do some damage while he's running after me. Because right now I'm not doing a whole lot of anything, so... Until he ends up back on the pup. Still on me? Okay. I'm gonna equip the pistol while I'm waiting for him to get back on the pup. Probably be a little easier to smack him around with it. Like that. Aha! Come on down! You're the next contestant on Leon's gonna knife your parasite off. <laughs> Quite done yet, I don't think. Oh, wait. Uh, Leon, don't run directly behind yourself, because uh, that's probably gonna. Oh, here he comes. Whoa. Okay. I was waiting for the dodge. I had my fingers on the button. But apparently we got him. Good job, pup. Oh. And look at that. Someone was nice enough to open the gates back up for me. <laughs> Well, all right then. Ooh, what do you got? Money? Lots of money. Nice. Oh, he smells. Ugh. Where'd my puppy go? Oh, he probably went back home. Let's see if I missed anything. Those acrobatics definitely aren't part of the Secret Service training. Good job, Leon. Yeah, he, he was just hamming it up there. He's like, I saw this in a movie once. I'm going to try it. <laughs> Handgun ammo. I'll take that. Uh, I missed something in here. TMP ammo, so money. Spinel. And a green herb. Okay. Really refilling my inventory quite a bit here. Hang on. Let's go over here. Bird nest? No. Get lots of money. Absolutely. I like lots of money. Lots of money is nice. He got whatever was in there. Okay. Gotta be ready for more people. I'm sure there will be. There's still that treasure over there that I still don't know how to get. So I guess I'll have to figure that out. At some point or another. Hmm. Let's use our rifle and see if we can see anybody else on the bridge. I got, like, what... 29, 36 ammo still for it, so I got quite a chunk. I'll leave that there in case I get another grenade of some kind. So, yeah, I think we're good. For now, let's see. I don't see anybody, but... I tried jumping through a window. Yes, yes I have. A big dive move that he does. Oh, it's just a lot. He goes flying when he jumps through windows. Is anybody in here looking to take me by surprise? No. But apparently I never looted this area, so I guess we'll do that now. Or maybe I did loot this. Yeah, this is where that one snake was as well. I must have gotten it already. Alright, nobody on the bridge. Anybody up here? Perhaps. Oh, there's the wolf pup. Hey, buddy. Not, not wolf pup, not wolf pup! This one's angry! Ow! You tricked me, you bastard! Oh god. 
Get off. Okay, well, that was not fun. <laughs> um, I'd like to keep this if I can. Okay, that's fine. I thought he was going to greet me before he left. Oh well. I guess it was worth a shot. But yeah, I still don't know how to do this thing yet. Still looking for three family insignias of the dead ringers. And I still don't know what the what the thing is for this. Yeah, not wolf pup. Not wolf pup! Ah! Oh, to get that treasure? Maybe it's behind a fence, but on the other side of a window. Oh, yeah, I haven't, uh, haven't done that yet. You mean back in that area? Yeah, I haven't done that yet. If there is anything in that area that falls under that criteria. Hmm. Other than the Bierstein. I did that for the Bierstein, though. Uh, we already got the bird's nests here, and I'm not going to use my shotgun to get them, so... This is barred from the other side. Yep. Okay. So destination is the church right now, so... I guess we'll go in there. Probably going to get lambasted by a bunch of church goers, but... Oh well. Okay. We have the round insignia. Remember this puzzle? You actually sat down and worked it out when you played, if I want to know. Uh, the only thing that I want to know, actually, for it is, is there a hint in the game anywhere that says, okay, this is how you, do, you might want to try doing this puzzle? If there's a hint, then I don't want to know. If there's no hint, then I also want to know that, because that will tell me, hey, I should probably go take care of it now. So is there a hint anywhere that says, hey, this is how you do this puzzle? Because uh, if the answer is no, I'm probably going to want to go do the puzzle now. So. I'll go, I'll go over to the puzzle just in case. I just saw one of the hints. Oh, the insignia. Oh, okay. Kind of. I thought the insignias had something to do with it. Okay. From the wall is one of the matching insignias on the puzzle. Isn't it like in pieces though on the puzzle? Let's see. Hmm. So, I'm trying to look for the thing that might actually make the insignia there. So like that maybe, and then let's do four, bring us there. I wish I got like a lock click or something to tell me, hey, you, you did it right, but uh, four, like that, one, two, three, four again. One, two, three, four. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, nope, that's not right. Okay. Here I thought I was slick. Um... Four would just take me back to that one. You have to turn it seven times for the actual answer, but in a specific order. Okay. Where do insignias sometimes go? On the doors of their houses? 
question mark? One, two, three. crafting in 14 at a late rework recently. Yeah, I, uh, I actually already redid all of my hotbars for it. So, um... I, I, I think it'll be better, honestly. Um, they, they worked in uh, Steady Hand, which is now gone from the game, but they worked it into a bunch of other skills now, so I think it'll be... I think it'll be better. So... Um... So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven total symbols. I don't know if you have to light them all up. Three, four. Does it unlight it? It does unlight it. Okay. That's six. Well, I don't know the answer yet. I'm thinking maybe we should go in the church first, honestly. Yeah, three dead ringers. I don't know what that means, though. I would assume it has something to do with, like, a church bell, but I... I've heard a church bell before, but that, that, that doesn't match up to any of the symbols that it says here. Or any of the symbols that show up here. Um, it's still like 90% trial and error even in your old notes of doing this puzzle <laughs> uh, man. Yeah, I'm trying to put the pieces together but I I don't know if I'm smart enough to actually put the pieces together. <laughs> um. So the first one has to be either the, the horn thing on the bottom right or the straight line on the bottom left. So... Esoteric puzzle in all reality. Read the clue again. Three family insignias of the dead ringers. Looks like the dial only turns clockwise in either three or four increments. Yeah, it doesn't help me. Not at all. Um. Shit. See, because I could keep going and relighting them, but I, it's definitely not light them all up. I know it's. It, you guys said it's in a specific order. So. Hmm. Seven, so that's not right. Three families. Where would there be family insignias near here? Uh, back in the village, maybe. Hmm. Do I have to go back to the village to figure this out? That seems. Seems like a long run. I guess I could, but... Are there any more dogs down here? Hmm. I don't 
see any, but I suppose there still could be. trying to give me hints. <laughs> I don't know if I'm smart enough to understand the hints there, Mr. Sunderland. <laughs> I guess we could just go in the church. I Again, I don't know if it's the correct way to go, but I'm gonna just... I know we can at least go in here, so... Well, there's three circles on the wall there. Some money here. I can't check it from here. Okay. Um, barrel. Okay, what we got there? Flash grenade? I'll take it. Nice. Kind of waiting to hear somebody shout at me from around the corner. <laughs> yeah, the village would be the only place that I would think of where families are near me. So... I can jump, apparently. I'm gonna have to, because this isn't going anywhere. Ashley's gotta be here somewhere. There's gotta be a way to open this. Okay. And who? There we go. This guy again. Okay, sparred from this side too. We got red, green, and blue operating switches here. We got there. Incendiary grenade, nice. Don't finish church, I'll miss the treasure. What about the cemetery? I guess the cemetery could, yeah. Oh, hold on, that's gotta move. There, there we go. Put that up there too. Um, yeah, I think we're good now, okay. So the cemetery might have what we're looking for, then. We'll come back. We'll come back in just a minute. Three dead ringers. One dead Leon when the dogs kill me. Okay. Twins must be buried under this grave. This insignia is a little different. Maybe they're different for all the graves. Okay. Twins must be buried. This insignia is a little different. I've seen this insignia before, but maybe they're different depending on the grave. That's that. Three dead ringers is also this. This is twins as well. Okay, so that's the top symbol on the on the uh, on the rotating thing back there. This is the two mountain symbol. Okay. And this is... was that a symbol? Maybe. Family's usually buried in the same place, yeah. That makes sense. So... With those symbols somewhat burned into my brain now, let's go over here and see if I can see what I need to do here. Let's see. Okay, so... Uh, I see two of them. The third one is not there, though, I don't think. 
Unless the third one is that bottom one. Because then I need the first, the third, and the fourth ones lit up. If that's the case. So, turn it this way. Now, how do I get to that one from here? Let's see here. I'll need to turn it off if I go four. Two, three. So I need to go nine to get to the third one. I turned it twice already. I'll need to turn that one back on and a few of them back off. Four, five, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Aha! Got it. Okay. Green Cat's Eye. Nice. Thank you for the help, because I would not have gotten that on my own. <laughs> so, gravestones, huh? The gravestones hold the key. Got it. So, we can combine that with the Beerstein. That makes it green and red. Now we're just missing... I would assume there's a yellow gem somewhere, or a yellow cat's eye, but I could be wrong. Because there's only three holes in it. Oh, excuse me. Alright, now we'll go in the church. Uh, over here. Three, 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 four, 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 three. So that's the normal combination to do it, huh? probably what I just did. I didn't really think about it based on the combination, but I just sort of was like, okay, what's the next move I need to make in order to get to this thing? So what color light will you operate? Uh huh? Okay, that's a little confusing. Did I get the red cat's eye? Yep, yeah, red cat's eye I got, so. Don't gotta worry about that one. I don't know what this is all about, though. Um, there's a down arrow on it. Let me see here. Oh, okay, I think I kinda understand. I need to turn these a little bit. Let's point all the arrows at it. No, that's not it either. Okay. Hmm. So the light will shine through where the... Oh, no, wait, I see it. Okay, I think I kind of see it anyway. So the green has to go there. So green's in the right spot. Red, I think, is now in the right spot as well. Blue needs to turn. No. Maybe. No, I don't think so. Oh, wait, hang on. Yeah, actually, that might be it. Oh, I was close. Okay. So... Turn the blue some more then. Let me see. No, that can't be right either because there has to be a thing on the side where the purple could go. So that should be right there. What am I missing here? Maybe the green needs to go somewhere else. Yeah, the green needs to go somewhere else, I think. So... No. I don't think so. Maybe. Uh, we're getting closer. So it has to be yellow, which means the blue and the green have to overlap there. Or no. That's not how that works. Right? No, yellow might just be where all three overlap. 
Hmm. I wasn't ready for all these puzzles, as you can tell. <laughs> uh, you know, that might be it, actually. Like for the red. Nope. Hmm. Okay, so where can the red go? That's not right because that triangle has to be there. But also needs to not be at the bottom so the blue can have a triangle there. Like that. So now the green has to have a triangle up in the top. No. No. Hang on. Yeah, like that. Aha! Got it. I just had to look at specific parts of it um, in order to figure out where the symbols go. So. I'll tell you though, I'm not the best at these puzzles sometimes. Sometimes my brain, I swear, my brain just turns off when it comes to some of this stuff. So. Oh, okay, well. No! Get away! Calm down. Everything's going to be just fine. My name's Leon. I'm under the president's order to rescue you. What? My father? That's yeah. Right. And I have to get you out of here. Now come with me. Okay, we found Ashley, so that's good. It's Leon. I've succeeded in extricating my subject. Good work, Leon. I'll send a chopper over right away. Awesome. Where's the extraction point. There's another trail that you can take to get out of the village. The chopper will pick you up beyond there. Got it. I'm on my way. Okay, cool. So we can get out of here with Ashley. Oh, playing manual three. Okay. Commands. You can press R1 to make Ashley either wait or follow. Ashley can and the action button. Depending on the situation, Leon and Ashley can cooperate to get past various obstacles. Ashley's health, you can use recovery items not only on Leon, but on Ashley as well. If Le and Leon has failed mission, if Ashley is either killed or carried away by the enemy. Okay, so we don't want to have her get carried away. Got it. Now comes the worst part of the game. Oh, boy. <laughs> well, we can uh, take Ashley with us now. Great escort mission. Just what I wanted. I got to Ashley. Almost done. Gonna look for the save point now. But let's see. Inventory look. Oh, I got a bunch of handgun and rifle ammo. What else is new? <laughs> yeah, you're doing pretty good. You got the puncher? Yeah. How's that working out? Pretty good so far. Gonna, Better than the handgun. Gonna work on something else. Getting a different oh, weapon oh, soon. But, okay, so I would assume. Yeah, okay, we gotta... We gotta let her jump down, too. The whole place? Uh, the church? Yeah, I think so. We got the green cat's eye as well. We figured the puzzle out. Oh, did you? Who are you? Oh, that thing. Oh, My name is Osman Sadler. Oh, so you're the big boss. Religious community. What do you want? To demonstrate to the whole world our astounding power, of course. Uh -huh. No longer will the United States think they can police the world forever. So, we kidnap the president's daughter in order to give her our power and then send her back. No. Oh. Yeah, that, that could be a problem. What did you do to her? We just planted her a little good. Oh, there's going to be one hell of a party when she returns home to her mother. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did. Oh, okay, I, was just that. I thought I might bargain with the president for some donation. Believe it or not, it takes quite a lot of money to keep this church up and running. 
Uh huh. Money will lead you nowhere, Sadler. Oh, I believe I forgot to tell you that we gave you the same gift when I was unconscious. Oh, I truly hope you like our small but special contributions. When the eggs hatch, you will become my puppets. Involuntarily, you'll do as I say. I'll have total control over your minds. Don't you think this is a revolutionary way to promulgate one's faith? I mean, it's revolting, so you're not far off. Uh-oh. Flaming crossbows. Jesus. These guys aren't playing around. You okay? Uh, Leon, what's gonna happen to us? Don't worry. We got into this mess. We can get out of it. I sure hope so. And that takes care of chapter two one. Nice. Okay, well, we've rescued Ashley, but apparently there's a deeper problem that's going to need to get solved. That being we need to purge the parasites from hers and probably our body. I don't know where the hell we're going to do that or, you know, wh what we're going to need in order to... We probably need some sort of, like, um, some sort of, like, uh, you know, vaccine or something, but I don't even know if one of those is created yet. The rest of the game is giant escort mission. few segments where it's not, but it's largely an escort mission now. The whole premise of the game is to rescue her. What'd you expect? Don't worry, basically, an immortal god of war. You'll be okay. <laughs> we'll be fine. I'll just, you know, figure out... I'll make her wait when I'm going and exploring somewhere, and then I'll make her follow afterwards or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out, but uh, for right now, that's going to do it for today's episode of Resident Evil 4 The Stream Edition. Come back next time when we attempt to take Ashley out of the village and get to the chopper. Hopefully the predators aren't waiting for us, because if they are, we might be in deep shit. But, thank you for watching, everybody. I appreciate you coming out to Twitch and YouTube. Check out the stream. And I will see all of you on the next one, which will be uh, next week. It'll actually be tomorrow at 4.30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. I'll be posting the um, schedule below the stream feed and also on Twitter, Discord, and YouTube just after this uh, stream is over and I get the description written for everything. So I'll take care of that, and I will see you guys tomorrow at 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, actually. I'll have to remember that because we turn the clocks back in the U.S. tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, we'll be back for more. So, until then, everybody, take care, and have a good night. And more of a god of time where he rewinds on death, yeah. I, I do have the power of saves, of saves on my side, so that sort of helps a little bit. It'll make escorting Ashley out of here a little simpler. <laughs>